Hart. If Isaac Newton was watching this man, he'd be saying, boy, was I wrong. This is what Einstein called a spooky action over distance. That's what he was on about. Amazing. They should near the constellation in the heavens after Lionel Messi. Sir Isaac Newton from up above looks down and says about that gravity thing, I was wrong. Messi was right. He teases gravity. This balance is astonishing. His feet are taken, applies the brakes, gets on the other side of the defender. It's amazing. Look at his balance. Better balance than a winner on a very rocky cruise ship. He stays upright. This man still going. You can't knock him over. Not knocked down. He got straight back up again. It was a good 10 seconds of messy magic. I'm sure there's a magnet in that. Well, look at the strength, Kevin, to hold off the challenge. And then running at the four defenders inside. Picks the spot. Oh, hard do you stop this little man. One of the rare breed as well who's just quick with the ball as he is without it. Look at that for a run. The centre of gravity. Ability just to go at defenders at pace. Keep that ball more or less tied to your foot. It's just absolutely astounding. It's not the statistics. It's not the statistics. You don't measure that by statistics. It's immeasurable. When you see this run again, Phil Shane, and your statistics, you tell me, how do you measure somebody that could balance a balloon in a wind tunnel on a needle? Because Messi is capable of that. It's Messi. Callum trying to rugby tackle him, but he's on the ground and Messi's still running. Yeah, he is so nimble and so strong as well. Great balance. Now Messi leaves the defender on the floor. And the okay. game. How embarrassing is that? Full gear, no foul. Oh, Messi does ever so well on the ground. And there's no space. There's no time. And that means nothing to Messi. Einstein looking down and see how happy talk with this guy he knows something I don't know amazing from Messi looking for Messi cuts back to his right tucks it around and makes the rabbit pop out of the hat as constant as a northern star and twice as radioactive absolutely genius again when we look at it again the trajectory is perfect the spin the dynamics beautiful Messi Summarizing stuff. Messi in his own time. Taking on all comers again. And is there any room? If there isn't any, he'll find it more often than not. So tight and congested, you think he can't get through. It's impossible. We watch him do this weekend, we go, look at that. And then he slots it underneath the goalkeeper. It's just unbelievable football. He reels his way through. There's no time or space here for Messi. Imagination in 3D. He sees all of his angles, he sees all of the options, and he says, I see you lads, I don't need you. Touch from Messi. Close control was mesmerizing. Oh, he's been just finding little pockets all evening. He's just such a hard player to man mark. And all he needs, a man of his quality, is half a yard because how he pulls the trigger with hardly any backlift, I'll never know. It's such magical work from him. Messi wiggles away from two. Comes it back to Messi. Messi trying to get away from Fontas. And succeeding, astonishing from Messi. The guy's a magician. I mean, the, the size of him, he shouldn't be doing what he's doing, really. Lionel Messi scaling the heights. Absolutely stunning here, Doug. He's only five feet seven. Into the middle, the header! And Messi does it again. Messi's header. Messi's goal. Look at that, the strength and power in his neck muscles to get that. It's just staggering. He stands five foot four. Look at Jumps that. six foot four. Oh, it's a fabulous header. Anybody would be proud of that in a number nine shirt. He's number ten. Messi. Smallest guy on the pitch and he still wins the ball. And he picks it over Cristiano Ronaldo who is tremendous with his vertical leaping. And you real. Yeah, he's <laughs> yeah, 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 even when you yeah. get tight around him, he finds a way to get through. He's that good. He sees this type of stuff clear. Other players, it goes hazy and they don't see it clear. He does. I, I just feel that he, in his own eyes and his own vision, yeah. the game just slows down for him. Yeah. He plays in slow-mo because it, it comes to him so easy and so naturally. He slows everything down in his mind and he's able to make decisions that end up in goals and does it weekend after weekend. He does things that nobody has ever seen before. He does things that nobody understands how he produces them. You know, he sees things that, that we don't see or wouldn't even consider 
one if it's possible and even attempting it. You sit here, I'm looking in the stands at times and looking at people look at that, looking to the sky saying, how is he doing that? And, and what is actually crazy, it, you guys have to understand that, he's virtually on the same step, he's coming back on his right foot. And now that, that, that it's not logical, because if I try to do that, obviously it's, it's kind of smaller. If I try to do that, you'll fall. 